In this video, we're going to take a quick look at a special case that can occur as we're solving absolute value equations. We know when solving absolute value equations, we must first get the absolute value alone. In this problem, 7 plus the absolute value of 2x minus 5 equals 4, we need to get that absolute value alone by subtracting 7 from both sides of the equation. As we do, we get the absolute value of 2x minus 5 equals negative 3. It's very easy at this point to run into the error of saying, take the 2x minus 5 and make it equal to positive 3 and negative 3. However, there is an error in doing this. Remember, we're taking the absolute value on the left side of the equation. If we ask ourselves, what does the absolute value do, we'll remember that the absolute value gives us the distance from 0, or makes the number positive. What is after the absolute value should always be positive if our absolute value is alone. Here, our absolute value is equal to a negative number absolute value will never be negative. Because absolute value will never be negative, we can stop here and say this problem has no solution. There is no value that we can plug in for x that would make this equation true, because it would require our absolute value to be negative, specifically negative 3. Since we can't have that from an absolute value, we say there is no solution.